Now, I'm recording it now. <laughs> and I'm going to explain the situation. The situation is I claimed that my friend Tuk Tuk or Pedro Francisco Fernandez Hernandez Rivera the third. I'm pretty sure that's not the original name, but fuck it, that's a better one. We're probably gonna, we're gonna forget it, and I'm gonna bring it up later. But uh, he's trying to stump me on a like on a subject, just any random topic, and I will try to talk about it for at least a good three minutes. And he claimed clouds, and that is a <laughs> terrible mistake. Clouds are white, fluffy. Do you remember clouds as a kid? Did you, did you ever just think, is that cotton? Can I sleep on that? Can I touch that? As a, as a kid, dreams represent a few things. Dreams, I mean, not dreams, clouds. Clouds represent, like, dreams. They represent fluffiness. Clouds were just like, if you saw a bed and the side of it had, like, a little cloud and you were like, oh, it's like sleeping on a cloud. You're just like, yes, clouds look so soft and fluffy. If I could stuff a pillow in a bed full of clouds, I'm sure I would sleep like a king. No, sleep like a god. Because you imagine the gods sleeping on clouds. Angels and gods. Just sleeping on clouds. And also the clouds are like, oh, above the clouds is heaven and all that good stuff. Praise Jesus! In the movies, anytime Jesus is coming in or like there's like a like super serious moment, like these dark clouds will part ways and sunlight will shine through on the hero or the Jesus statue or the, yeah, something symbolic. And it's just like clouds. Also, I mean, I gotta admit, like I do like the way clouds just clash against the sky of blue. Although it feels like during the noon, like the sky's blue is like a little more dim. A little more dim, yeah. And it's just like, I don't know, man. It's fucking clouds are just. They're, they're, they're a symbol at this point. They're, like, they're an existing thing, they're science, but then there's the symbolism behind them, and then putting them in a painting, and then clouds. Everything in the world is, has meaning as long as a human, a human being is willing to give it some sort of meaning. Like, clouds, uh, we give it the symbolism of softness and or, like, peaceful tranquility. Along with a babbling brook. Is that a brook or a river? Like, what's, what's a brook? A babbling brook, what is that? I'm gonna say it's an Irish word for river or creek. I'm gonna say it for myself, but I imagine the Irish would say that. Anyways, but yeah, man, it's like, clouds can become a symbol. Like, we've had all kinds of symbols. Like, we give it the meaning of that and bullshit and... But really, scientifically speaking, clouds, all it is is water vapor in the air that's kind of taken collectively with dirt and shit. So, you know, fucking clouds are what you make of them. Especially if, like, you want to make them into shapes in your brain. At that point, it's a Rorschach test to see, like, what can you see? How creative are you? Like, um... I'm not creative, I can't think of anything. <laughs> I see death. I smelled death earlier, remember I told you that? Yeah. I don't know what you hit, but for a second, I smelled death. Death smells like rotten animals on the side of the road. Do not smell good. Anyways, yeah, three minutes. I hit three minutes. Are we good? Oh, Got any yeah. more subjects, or are you good? Uh, I'm out of ideas right now. You're out of ideas. So day one, round three, which is the fourth or fifth time we've done this? <laughs> Third time? Well, third time I win all 30 rounds. Come back tomorrow to re-challenge me. Or, you know, later today, I really don't care. <laughs> I'll probably give you another one. At the end of the day, it's like, so we can have the witnesses of your brother and whoever else is around? Yeah. yeah. Alright, screw it. I'm down. Anyways, this has been Wild Wicked Wanderer. I'm sorry that at, um, for right now you're going to get these kinds of videos because the internet's down at the house. So, yeah, that sucks. <laughs> so, yeah. so, later, Rodriguez Hernandez Fernandez Paco. I don't remember what I said the first time. I'll remember whenever I watch this later. Yeah. Alright, bye anyone who watches this.